way of adding some color or patina in adverted commas to metal embossing is using a permanent marker and I use the permapack um, opaque pigment marker and this should not be confused with a sharpie um, what the beauty of this marker is that if you apply it you do still have an opportunity to move the ink from the surface of the embossing and create some dimension and interest so the way that I do this is I make sure that I apply the, the marker very kind of thickly I'm not doing a this and that I make sure that I kind of have a very uh, thick application of the marker and because it dries so quickly I do make s small sections and as soon as I fold the metal with the marker I take a paper towel and I like to wipe in one direction and wiping in one direction forces the ink into the recesses and removes the ink from the raised areas so I fold my paper towel in four I make sure that I color quite thickly and make sure that you're into the recesses close up your marker take your paper towel fold it in four and do a flat hand wipe and I do like to work in one direction so wipe 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 and you can see that it forces the ink into the recesses there and you have a quick and easy patina if you find that some of the areas uh, you would like to remove more of the ink and you had um, it had dried already you can either juice it up again with the pen as it is so if you hydrate it again with the ink usually it allows you to move it again uh, alternatively you can use an alcohol swab and just wipe off all the ink and then start again so you can see the contrast between the areas that have the marker patina and the other side that doesn't and you can see that it it creates a nice um, interest and makes your engraving and your embossing stand out.